Hi, welcome to my Arch Lab system here. We are going to show you how to install a new icon theme. And it applies to all operating systems, and where the first part will be on Arch Labs or Arch Linux, and the second part will be for any distro. Let's first look and see if we like any of it. So XFCE appearance, icons, and we're gonna talk about this here. So we you really should check out Eric Bottle BE because the Sardi icons are explained there, a lot of tutorials on there. Because Sardi is, the intention of Sardi is that you change it, that it's flexible, it's modular. So any time, any element here that you see that has the word Colora inside, means you have scripts, you can change it. Every time you see flexible, it means you have scripts, you can change it. So these are on the intention, there are, there are SVGs and not PNGs because a PNG you can't change it. Well, it's very difficult. An SVG is just a text file. Just uh, do a script and tell, okay, this blue changed to that red, and then you have a new icon theme. So that's the general idea of Sardi. I provide raw material, you do the creativity. But if you say, well, whatever, there's also scripts that I, uh, I ran, and you can download and install already what I've made. So Sardi Monopapyrus Colora is the topic. Let's get to it. The guys from Arch Labs do packet. Just type on what you see to the right there. Sardi Monopapyrus Colora. Say you like this, then you press enter, and then it says, yep, there are variations on the theme. So you can install them, they've already been created. So these scripts that are inside there, I ran them. I uploaded them to a GitHub, and that's where other people will get it for their distro. So it's now installed. Let's take a look how it looks. We need to close everything up. File manager again open, and let's check. Now he reads the new ones. Let's make it a bit bigger. So this is the normal standard SATI icons you can download from SourceForge. And then, with all the scripts, you see here Sardi Monopolis Casablanca. All right, let's go. This is the Casablanca look, all right? So there are 16 million colors. I just took a few colors and said, well, maybe people will like this, maybe people will like that. But it's personal. Colors is personal. So there is the scripts and there is 16 million colors. You change them. But this is what you get when you download it. There's some nice ones in there, I think. Also some extreme colors. Why not? Why always be so uh, docile? Choose any of the 60 million colors, run a script, and you have your own system. And it's up to you to decide what color you like and what color you don't like. But this is the Sardi Mono Papyrus Colora with all the variations. So that's installed on Arch Labs. What if? What if? Okay, you go to the GitHub, and in um, in there you'll find all the Sardis are in here. And what we need to look for is a Sardi Mono Papyrus Colora. So you type in Sardi Mono Pap, and that's enough. So this one, this is everything we just saw: Casablanca, Cornflower, Gainsborough, Mans, Turquoise, and so on. So this is the the ones we just uh, selected. And I'm in doubt, so I'm gonna check Cornflam, Gainsborough. Yeah, that's okay. That's the one. So Casablanca is the one I kind of like. And that's here. So what do you do if you don't have Arch Labs? You just install it. You download the zip, show a folder. This can be gone. That one should be gone. This one is the one I downloaded extract here so this is what we have Casablanca delete these these are just for github stuff and then you get this one control C or control X whatever and then you put it in your icons your hidden folder so the home folder dot icons you don't have it make the icon theme the folder I mean then eh? and then up there it is you can now select it as well on any distro so go to your theme uh, manager and select uh, any of those and you'll have a nice uh, Sardimono Papyrus Colora variation. Enjoy.